Abby. Robert. John. Respectful researchers, we are here at Waverly Hills, finally. Long awaited visit. We're just about to get started. We're here with our very good friend, um, Jay from The Journey is the Destination, Carl, Nancy and Nick from Hunting the Haunted. Um, check their channels out down below. Let us know if you hear anything or see anything. We're probably gonna do something on each floor and some alone and also the body shoot. So there'll be quite a few videos. We won't release them all at once, so keep checking back. All right, guys, keep safe. We love you. Bye, guys. Are you here with us? Can you see the SLS camera screen? I can't see it at all. No, I don't even know where it is. I can't see it. <laughs> Turn the chair sideways, Robert. So the back is facing you. Yeah. So we can see it if a figure pops up. Somebody in here with us tonight? Are you angry? Do you make people angry? And the reason we're asking that is because on the tour, we got told that the tour guide actually almost blacked out for like a day after he got told to leave here because he was being angry. After he picked up a very, very large figure on the SLS walking towards him. Yeah, yeah over there by the mountains. We have the rampart on the floor over where he witnessed the SLS figure and just as I started to film we had some rampart activity didn't catch much of it but I think I caught some would you be able to touch one of those boxes for us please If we are disturbing you and you want us to leave you alone, you can tell us by touching one of them little boxes. And we're actually located right at the front door of Waverly Hill, so every patient came through here, everybody that entered the facility came in this way. Were you a patient here? How long have you been here? Are you really sad instead of mad? I know sometimes people are misunderstood. I'm gonna take our special camera where we can see you and walk over there a little bit. If you wanna come out and show yourself, we'd love that. We don't think you're mean. We don't mean you any harm or disrespect. And just in case you didn't know, our names are Debbie, Robert and John. And we're just here to talk to you. We know you get a lot of visitors. 
You're probably tired of us all walking around. Can you come back, please? I know I just saw you. There you are. Hello. Very tall. You are very tall. We're very pleased to meet you, sir. I'm assuming you're a sir. That's our reflection over there. It made me jump a little. Oh, over there? Yeah. Thank you, sir. Could we ask you some questions? It's actually like... <laughs> Could you make that light up a lot more? Just go ahead and grab it. Or kick it. Oh. Or just go away. <laughs> we did say that, I did say that they could do it, that we would leave him alone if he would show himself and make that go off. Do you want us to leave you alone? Would you like us to leave and go to a different area? If you do, very tall, like he said. Yeah, it's very tall. Now what are you doing? Are you going to kick it? Go ahead. We give you permission. Throw it across the floor if you want. If you want us to leave, that box that you're near, that you've been touching, touch that again. If you want us to stay... It looks like he's bending one... down, looking down at it. Like, what the hell is this thing? If you want us to stay, Thank there's you. another box over this side. Go and touch that one if you want us to stay. It's just the same. So the one you already touched, if you want us to leave, touch that one again. Is John over here? Yeah. Could you tell us your name? We haven't been formally introduced. And we apologize for just walking in and just saying, hi, I'm Debbie, Robert, and John. Is that you, Tommy? Mm -hmm. Hello again. Hello. So we will keep to our word. If you set that off for us just one more time, it doesn't matter if it's one little beep or a bunch of beeps. We will go ahead and let you along. That's my stomach, everyone. <laughs> Knock it off. Go um. ahead, do it. You touch it just once and we'll go. It is still working, isn't it? I mean, I know the red light's on, but... I'm sure it is. I don't think they actually touched it. They were maneuvering, maneuvering around it, trying to decide, I think. Yeah, see. That's me backing up everyone. I don't think he wants us to leave, but he's not sure. So he's like, I'm not going to touch it just yet. I'm not annoyed by you yet. Were you a patient here? Or did you work here? What's the matter? I don't know if you'd seen something. Took it just looking around. Yeah, just looking around. <laughs>
Are there people coming in and out right now? That was my stomach again, everyone, sorry. Can you come out and show yourself to us? scared of you. We don't mean to scare you or hurt you. Those voices are some other team members from the other team. Let's go over back over where we did catch a figure just a little bit before we leave here because it sounds like people are coming this way. Do you just hang out in the corner and watch people and wait for people to come in here? Because if so, I'm going to come over here and say hello to you. You're right over here, aren't you? I know you are. No? No, they're behind you. That, no, they're not. There they were. behind you I swear and they're just like it was almost like you turned there we go okay you want us to leave then we did ask you if you did that touch yeah. that one yeah, yeah. Just said it again and oh, yeah. start going. Okay, right. we will keep to our word, sir. All right, thank you, sir. You do not have permission to leave with us. You must stay here. Yes. But thank you for allowing us to spend some time with you and talking to you. All right, guys, I'm going to switch the camera off. And uh, we're going to walk over to the body shoot. Hey, is the cafeteria on this?